Hey everybody, welcome to ICAST 2013. My name is Al Norker. I'm with the Wright McGill Company here in, uh, actually out of Denver, Colorado. And what I want to show you today is one of the newest introductions we have at this year's ICAST. It's the Eagle Claw inline reel. This has so many really interesting features and it's a reel that is going to change the way you fish for crappie. And I can tell you that the people who have tried this, they love it. What we have here is kind of a hybrid reel. It's a crossover between a spinning model, a casting model, and a fly reel. Some of the key features are we've extended the foot up here so you can easily put your fingers around the reel much like a spinning reel. But it looks like a casting reel in its round design. It has a casting style handle, nice large star drag, very smooth but powerful drag. It does have a clicker on this so you, if you need to set it with a clicker, you can kind of hear that working for you right now. But let me show you one of the key features on this reel. Many times, whether you're ice fishing or fishing for crappie, you want to be able to drop a very small, lightweight jig straight down without any line twist. Spinning reels really don't allow you to do that. This reel does. All we're going to do is we're going to turn the reel to this side so you can see it easier. We're going to push this one little button in right on that side. And now watch this. You just spin that spool, and you can realize how fast you can drop a very lightweight jig straight down without any line twist. That spool is still spinning. We make this in both a all graphite version, so it has a graphite body, graphite frame, and a graphite spool. This happens to be the step-up model. It has a graphite body and frame, but it has an aluminum spool, and again, very smooth. As soon as you want to set that, you just turn the handle that much, about an eighth of a turn, it stops that and now you're in the retrieve mode just that fast. The new Eagle Claw inline reel, you're going to love it. Got to get yourself one of these.